Can you imagine what would have happened if we would have spent those three first round picks to invest in the team with Jimmy Garoppolo? <laughs> I I don't want to say it. I was a trade stand. I kind of still am. Um, but could you imagine Parsons on this team? Could you imagine? I was I was on the phone with Vis yesterday, and we were talking like. I think it's fair to say that trading up to three was a mistake. Once they got to three, they took the guy I would have taken. But trading up to three, I don't think there was a right answer once they got there. Your choice was the kid from North Dakota State who's played one year or the Ohio State quarterback or not a quarterback. Like, those are terrible choices in retrospect. Yeah. And you did it all during a pandemic with no combine and you didn't really know any of these guys. Like, that was the mistake, not necessarily who they took, just the yeah. aggressive move. And it felt emotional, almost like, Jimmy was hurt and I'm mad and like, I don't know. We don't want to fuck with Jimmy anymore. That's what it was. And Exactly. All that. Know, but and, and they needed to replace Jimmy, but not like that. Not no. like that. Not like not that. Not send him out of town on a rail, basically. <laughs> you know, and what, for what he did for this organization, for where they were at, for what he did for Kyle and for John, saving both their asses and their jobs, basically. Come on, dude. Like the way you sent him out was pretty heinous in my mind. And then, you know, the biggest thing, this is what, you know, for, to answer your question. But, I mean, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's see from the Niners' perspective. I think their perspective was kind of what the Patriots f players' perspective was. Like, dude, yeah, you get hurt and it's not your fault, but, like, you don't come back that quickly. And, like, you know, there was 2020 yeah. where he missed 10 games with a high ankle sprain, and then there was this year where there was words like, hey, he might come back. And I think that's why they didn't sign Roethlisberger. They signed Josh Johnson. I think they were hoping he would want to. And I think they felt like he let him on and didn't play, which – I'm actually on his side on that, like he shouldn't have played, but I think that's the, they felt, and I think Martellus Bennett feels like this guy doesn't push hard enough to play, and he's the franchise quarterback, we need you out there more. I think that's kind of, like, you can't that's rely like on him. the mentality dude. in the NFL though, this isn't the NBA, yeah. you know what I mean? You can't yeah. be Kawhi Leonard in, right. in the NFL. We're and he's, he's, got Kawhi in getting, he's got a little Kawhi in him, he's got a little Kawhi to him, Jimmy Kawhi. Garoppolo. <laughs> yes, he does, and <laughs> I think that, that was their problem. Yeah, 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 that's, not yeah, the, yeah. that's not the culture yeah. and and then yeah. here's here's what i want to ask john lynch is what the fuck how can you do that to, to you what your fans like we trusted you like the big thing was when we when you traded those three first round picks i trusted the 49ers i was like look at the, all the development they've done right. look at all these players they so it, it, it feels like a risky move but the niners are doing it and if anybody's you know, gonna do it yeah them. they have you know a plan and they're yeah. and they're smart and they've so sure and then all of a sudden to just abort the plan after he, not even really starting it it's like wait oh, a dude. second you How let us on for you, two dude. years yeah yeah those aren't yeah. your fucking picks i'm sorry i'm getting get yeah. a little emotional yeah about these aren't those aren't your picks dude those are the 49ers yeah. picks that's San true francisco's picks dude true like what are you doing like right. the, after those picks will keep coming after you're gone like yeah. that's a fact right those those right. don't belong to you dude like at the end of yes. the day when you make an investment like that you got to fucking see that through and they didn't I think give so. them a chance dude like they didn't even let him throw the ball, man. Like, like it's it, what it must say something terrible about Trey. You know, I live in Denver currently, and Paxton Lynch was the big thing. You know, right. here when they drafted him, and he right. blew it. And then they said that his thing was he was on the Xbox twenty four seven, wouldn't get off the damn Xbox. You know, okay. and okay, and was like a Madden superhero or something. And okay, you know, he was better at Madden than he was at, at football. He was better at, yeah. at virtual football than actual football. That's He's good. like, I'm a yeah. fucking great NFLer because you know I, I'm awesome at Madden. If you guys saw my oh Madden wow. Career profile okay you know? but anyway is that wow. the problem with trey i know you kind of have a little bit more insight haven't heard knowledge. that haven't, haven't heard, heard that then what, i think they felt that he partied a little bit last off season maybe they felt yeah. he was doing too much of that he was 21 20 21 maybe 22 yeah. um he was and he's you know, he, he went from like little, little small town uh, minnesota or whatever to the bay and there were you know was that video of him like making it rain i think probably was a young man who made a couple young man mistakes and then now you got brock purdy who's a squeaky clean super religious guy who probably would never do anything and that's like who that john and, lynch is john yeah. that's who john lynch is squeaky clean catholic hardcore yes. and, and you know yeah exactly and yeah. like so i'm that, not saying that that's yeah. a bad thing thank you like for your yeah. you know what you've done sure. for this organization you've done a great job sure. but you need to not see that shit with your uh with your yeah. emotion because again yeah. like your culture will be gone one day and this team will yeah. still be here that's right. That's right. You know what I mean? That's a good point. Connecting it to Lynch. Yeah, absolutely. I can see Lynch being totally turned off by that. Dude. Yeah. We're handing like, you the Whoa. team. We're getting rid of Jimmy Garoppolo, and this is what you do. I can see him being turned off by that. Yeah. Because Peyton Manning too? would never do that, right? He would never do that. Right. Or right. yeah. But, but Peyton hey, look, I'm not saying Trey Lance is a franchise called. quarterback. I don't know. Maybe he's not. But again, like I don't think you can just send him away after a few bad practices, an injury, and a and a, and a party. Like, wait a second, man. 
You he's 22 still. You got to you got to because here's the thing. It's not a but it's not the worst trade of all time yet. But once you trade him for a third round pick, it's done. It's over. He's off your team. It's officially the worst trade ever. Those first three, those three yeah. first round picks. It's officially a bust. It's official. It's officially incompetence. It's not official it's yet. A, it's already. It's already kind of is because first round picks play, bro. You you trade three of those bad boys. You should. You need to play. You it, maybe. You, that's the thing. You need to play him right away. I've ne- who who trades bro, up for the third pick who? and says I'm going to sit him for a year. You can't three, do that. Three picks. You can't do that. Three picks and he's not. Yeah. Playing. He's got to play. In retrospect, he should have stayed in school. I don't yeah. understand what his, – his, his, it ruined his career because he wasn't ready. He went to a team that was poor for him, and now he'd be in a much better position if he stayed in school. Yeah. And um, here's the thing, dude. You lose a game uh, in Chicago, and then you go out, and you're doing that party and then throwing money at strippers or whatever that night. That's probably – I don't know that that's what happened. That I don't know that that's what happened. Made. But the way that it came out made it seem like that's what happened. Like he lost, and then I don't. It seemed like more like that was a video that happened from the summer that got leaked at the wrong okay. time. But I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, that was bad. And honestly, I was getting. I haven't released them, but I was getting pictures sent, DM to me I've heard you all summer, that. being like, "Hey, man, this is your quarterback." And it, it wasn't doing anything bad. It was just here he is at a party in Mexico. Here he is, and it's like, dude, he's like, twenty one. He needed to do yeah, exactly, that exactly. But it's like, man, like That's, you're the franchise that. quarterback of the Niners. Uh, you yeah, got to be discreet. Like Jimmy's discreet. I'm sure Jimmy yeah, does. No you know whatever he wants to do. When I was out there acting a fool. You know what I mean? But it, it, you're yeah. Trey Lance. You know, like right, right. <laughs> do that. And you yeah. haven't won yet, and it's controversial yeah, that yeah, you're yeah. getting they're taking this guy's job, right? A lot of people feel you're just you got to hand it to you, and so you got to be above board and look at Brock. He's doing all, doing everything right. <laughs> Waving. What a wave. Man, I hope he does great. I mean, I, I Me actually, too. you know, I love the kid. You know, he's a yeah. young man too. I think you know, I'd be proud for him to represent my organization, our organization. You know, but um, man, it's just the way that they blew it with Trey, dude, is just disappointing, man. Like, I, it kind of, I just don't understand all going all in with Brock. It, it's like you got him. Don't make another. He trade might be like a starter, that, Kyle John. Yeah. Don't make another trade like that, dude. What are you because, doing? Like, no, you, don't. Come on, don't, don't do it again. Up. Because that's you. You ruined that. <laughs> you ruined but. it. You ruined it. All right, man. Good call. 